Hi friends, welcome back to The Classy Mommy. I'm Brittany and I'm glad you're here. And I've lost my voice, but we're going on with it. In today's and this week's outfits of the week, I am starting to bring in more springy, late winter, early spring pieces, and then trying to make them work for right now, specifically colors and textures. So here's my outfit of the day. Yes, it has pockets. I love pockets. It's a quite long midi length dress actually. Um, the top is a spaghetti strap dress. <clears throat> so perhaps for the summer I'll wear it just like that when I'm home. But um, I've seen a few people kind of layer and then tie t-shirts over the top of their dresses to just kind of mix up the style and I really liked that. I just tied it with a ponytail and tucked it under in the back. And then this jean jacket, <clears throat> I am so glad that I found this in my spring summery box. I forgot that I had this, which is so cool. Um, one of the reasons why I love storing away all my non-seasonal clothes. I thought that I'd gotten rid of this because it is quite cropped. And you guys know I typically like longer length things, especially in my torso. Um, <clears throat> so I have some mid-wash and dark wash jean jackets that are full length. But this one, I'm so glad I saved it because I don't wear it with like pants or shorts, but I do like wearing it with sundresses. I feel like it hits right at my natural waist spot, which is really flattering. In fact, I had this on just trying it on last night and I put just a, a regular more loose fitting jean jacket and I thought well that's probably the, the best I'll get and you know it just kind of looks frumpy and dowdy having the overs uh, the top a little voluminous and the bottom because this is quite flowy anyways I really like how today's outfit turned out uh, my necklace kind of coordinates with the blue my earrings and my teacher watch and just a really light sheer color on my fingernails um, <clears throat> already I've had so many kids and adults in my building say, oh, you look so nice. Oh, you look so ready for spring. And I am, but I feel like this is a great way to still have a lot of warmth, um, but bring in some springy, summery colors. And on my feet, if you watched last year's videos, you saw these all the time. They're from um, Born, or no, I'm sorry, B-O-C. There we go. And I got them on Amazon last year. Just simple little um, nude colored wedges. And Yep, got my toenail polish out and did my toes because I knew I wanted to wear them. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hi guys, welcome back. I'm still hoping for spring. It's sunny outside, so I'm pulling out my springy colors, which I'm just loving so much. Um, I was really excited to see that most of my outfit is pre-owned or thrifted today. <clears throat> um, this top, um, however, is not, but it is for and a half years old. It's from Target and it's actually held up really well. I haven't seen this color in recent years, but um, I do, I have seen the same um, style. I probably won't leave this um, scarf on very long, but I wore it um, with my jacket coming in and it's a little chilly and it actually does match some of the lighter blush um, flowers in here. I'll take it off in a moment and show you my top underneath. These are my navy blue Eileen Fisher pull-on pont pants. And I do really like that they're just a little bit more um, loose and flowy than like um, leggings or um, really tight skinny jeans but I do like that it's still tapered and hits at my ankle all right down below I have my navy um, blue uh, Vera Ferragamo pumps which you've seen so many times before uh, just my pearls my wedding ring and I like this um, light springy color um, fingernail polish I've got on and I tried to match it with my lipstick and I'll um, show you my top underneath. Here's my shell underneath. I do have a camisole underneath it. <clears throat> it is spaghetti straps um, so I will not be taking off my cardigan while I'm at school and really I don't really wear a lot of spaghetti straps um, in general. I just get a little too cold unless it's super hot outside. I really love the colors in this. This is from White House Black Market. It's lined. It's from uh, maybe three or four years ago. This one I did get pre-owned, my bottoms I got pre-owned, my shoes I got pre-owned. <clears throat> um, this cardigan is new and of course my camisoles are, I always get those new. I like that it has a little bit of navy. Um, I don't think there's any blacks in here, but just some darker navy details. I love this blush. Sometimes I wear this um, shell with um, this color of a uh, shorter cardigan, which I love. And I love all the different shades of blue. <clears throat> I feel like it's just super um, calming and relaxing for me. I love these colors. I still feel like it's very light and springy, and I've really been enjoying wearing these spring colors because of course my personal um, coloring is spring, so I always feel my most alive and vibrant. And <clears throat> if you've been watching for a while, you know I've been 
really on and off sick for about the last four to five months, just everything. I've got two littles and I just kind of been getting everything that they bring home from childcare. I feel like I've been picking up almost everything for my students at school and I've been just having a hard time being on the up and up. <clears throat> I'll have like a few days here and there where I'm feeling good and then I catch something else. <clears throat> but anyways, wearing these colors are just have felt really therapeutic to me because I just feel very calm and very relaxed in them. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hi friends, welcome back. Another day of a lot of thrifted pieces. I'm feeling super excited about that. This is not a thrifted video, but um, I just love that I have so much of that in my wardrobe. Um, <clears throat> this top is thrifted. You've seen this before. You saw this last spring, if you saw my last spring videos. It's um, not a full wrap, but it's like a cross. And then it does attach at the bottom, but it's a little short. So I just always wear it um, kind of tucked in. I think it looks really nice that way as well. And of course I just have my camisole underneath. Um, you've seen this necklace earlier this week as well. This is a little um, salmon-y pink um, springy colored cardigan long sleeves. I got this at Downey's Basics. They seem to have the same style and a ton of seasonally appropriate colors just constantly year round and I really like it. I did size up, this is a size large. And I feel like normally I would take a medium, but in some of their pieces, I feel like they're a little bit more sized for <clears throat> like not necessarily youth, but kind of a mix between like youth and young woman sizes. So anyways, I uh, do size up in this and I feel like it fits exactly how I would um, want it to. Um, this belt is, I mean, I did purchase this new, but it's about four years old from Abercrombie & Fitch. <clears throat> These chinos are from The Gap. They're called a girlfriend chino. And I know this is the darkest spot in my whole classroom, but trust me, it's just the only spot that works to have the mirror and not be interrupted by um, students in the hallway. Um, but these are actually a very light wash. See if you can see the color like this. Um, <clears throat> but they are a, a chino chambray linen blend. So I feel like they are like um, cut like a work pant and they're not denim. So I feel like it, it <clears throat> is work appropriate for me. So this is my alternative to jeans when I want to wear uh, like one of my light blue jeans to work. And of course on Fridays I can wear the actual denim. But in person these definitely look like a linen-y cotton blend um, spring kind of work pant. <clears throat> my feet, uh, nothing new here. You've seen these before. My patent um, Veragamo Verabo pumps and I love those. So that's my springy outfit of the day. And I try to sort of match my lipstick with the color family I'm wearing. And of course, I always love wearing a lot of peaches and corals. So I've got this on here and that's my outfit. All right, I'll see you guys soon. Welcome back. It's my first bare-legged day because it's getting so warm. Here's my outfit of the day. Um, this is a three-quarter sleeves boat neck dress from Garnet Hill. I got it thrifted last year and I love it. It's even got pockets and it comes right above my knee. Um, I've just paired it with these off the beaten trail boots I've had for probably four or five years. This moto jacket is a faux suede jacket. I think it looks a lot like the one from Nordstrom, the one it's called, um, or it's by Blank NYC. But this one was much cheaper and I really enjoy it from Old Navy about two years ago. This was a taupe color. Um, so I haven't seen this color recently. And to be honest, I don't know if they have this style jacket right now. They did have it for over a year, just in different seasonal colors. I don't know if they still have this one. It's just called a faux suede moto jacket and it's really, really stretchy. So it does feel almost like, like the amount of stretch um, as wearing like a sweatshirt. I have it um, buttoned up because I feel like when it's undone, it's just a little boxy on me. So this gives a little bit more shape and still very, very comfortable. Uh, my dress and my boots, so pretty simple today. But I am super excited about not having to wear tights or leggings today because it's so warm. Um, not incredibly warm, but you know, we're just coming off winter. It's still winter, so I'm, I'm taking the victories. On top, tomorrow. I have this chambray um, top and I rolled it up. I have it a little unbuttoned with my camisole, of course. Um, I did tie, um, I don't remember where, I've heard this a few different places. I did tie like my daughter's little elastic right there and then I just <clears throat> tuck it into my jeans and that kind of keeps it from untucking through the day. And I really like that. I think I heard that from Erin from Busby Style. I think I heard that from her first. <clears throat> but I know that's kind of a, 
like a fashion hack that's been out there for a while. I have this cognac belt from Abercrombie. These uh, white jeans are from Tommy Hilfiger and they were thrifted a couple years ago. They're kind of like a little bit more of a relaxed, almost like a girlfriend kind of fit. <clears throat> so I think next time I wear these, maybe I'll wear a more fitted top so I can have that a little bit more balance and proportions. I've just cuffed them here at the bottom and I'm wearing these um, thrifted Clark's booties again. So this was thrifted. This is originally from Target. It's the Mosmo brand, but I thrifted this. I did buy the belt new. Um, my shoes were thrifted. <clears throat> Earring is all, um, the jewelry is all new, my earrings. Um, this one, you, I don't think you guys have seen, at least in a long time. Um, I've had that since high school. Wedding ring, a teacher watch, and hair's just back today. So I guess besides the belt and um, the um, my camisole, which I always buy those new and they're so inexpensive, the rest of this is thrifted. So yay for me. I wasn't even trying to do that, but all right, I'll see you guys tomorrow.